for this experiment, you will need a bowl full of water, warm or cold, doesn't really matter, dry ice, and this strip of cloth has been soaking in bubble solution. Um, just put a bunch of random amounts of dry ice in there. Make sure that they're fairly decent sized chunks so then they'll sink better. No. Okay, that's good. And um, take your bubble solution. Take your bubble solution. Just go across the brim of it. Like that. That's what happens when you blow on it. Um, it works a lot better if you hold them down under the water with your hands in it. But we're not going to do that. Take it and just kind of stroke it across. Here, I'll do this part. Stroke it across like this. To form a bubbly thing. Film. Film. And now it'll just fill up with the carbon dioxide that the chunks of dry ice are putting off. Come on, Dad, Ryan. Form a bubble. Dave. This is really not exciting. Can't even see it. You can't. Zoom in. Here, use this and dry your hands. There you go. Um, it's still filling up. Still filling up. I'm just gonna pop it. No, I want to see how big it'll get. Now, watch this. Whenever you pop it, it's cool. Oh. I want it. Just like that. For this experiment, what you will need is a cup. I just use a measuring glass, mixed with some soap and dry ice. That's about it. Um, when you put the dry ice in there, it doesn't do much. Well, it does. But for it to really work, you have to push it down with your spoon, and um, it'll make bubbles faster than this. It's only going slow because I already used this dry ice a couple times. But um, once you take them, they're bubbles, and usually if you pop them, you can see the uh, stuff coming off. It's not really working very well. I'm gonna get fresher dry ice. Fresher. There we go. It's fun to play with. Because they just pop into little CO2 gas. And that's about it quick and easy. And for this experiment, I'm going to be holding the camera. All you need is just dry ice and a sidewalk. Just put some in your hand. There. And then throw it on the sidewalk. And then it just fizzes up. That's it. Hope you enjoyed our short and random video of dry ice experiments. Goodbye.